The problem with these teachers nowadays who are liberal is that they tell their students that they're liberal. That's a huge problem because I used to teach and I, my, my students never knew what political affiliation I was because that is what you're supposed to do. You're not supposed to ever say, hey, I'm a right winger. I'm a left winger. You're supposed to teach the damn subject. That is what your job is. That is your only job <laughs> is you're, t- you're supposed to teach. And these teachers aren't doing that. These teachers are going in and they're trying to fulfill an agenda and impose that agenda onto the kids. That's not that's not what you're supposed to. You're not being paid to do that. And it, I'm, that was what made me so grateful for my kid's history teacher last week. Uh, uh, my kid came home and said, oh, we had this discussion about capital punishment in our social studies class, our world history class. And I, w- I immediately braced myself. Like, how did this yeah, go? Yeah. And um, the teacher said, like, this teacher actually said the words, if you are able to tell my political stance, then I am not doing my job right. Amen. And I was like, hallelujah. A this is exactly to what the teaching men. is supposed to right? look like. Right. It is. It is. And, I, and they exist. These teachers are out there and they exist and God bless them because they have to live among the crazy that is just permeating our schools. Um, What bothers me, too, is that a lot of these we were like like Mock said, we were inundated with with emails and people like telling us this is what's happening in my school. Oh, my gosh. Like this looks so much like my school and this is happening here. And here's an example. Here's another example. Here's another. We were inundated. I mean, this is happening everywhere, y'all. And what what kills me is that. That I think a lot of conservatives feel helpless. They feel like they can't do anything to fight it. And I think a lot of um, that stems from the fact that they're afraid that they're going to get backlash because for so long, conservatives have been swel- squelched and for so long they've been silenced and they feel like I, I can't do anything because I may lose my job. I may lose, I don't know, friends. I may be called a racist. I may be, you know, the possibilities are endless, right? And they just feel like they're going to be squelched. And it's America. Like, we shouldn't feel that way. We should be able to say what we want. We should be able to do what we want. Our kids should be able to go to school and be freaking kids. (laughs) 